woke on the run. Thank God. So there is a backlash against all this woke uh, DEI stuff. And when people say to me, O'Reilly, the nation has had it. It's going down a drain. It's not coming back. I always say history goes in cycles and we can never predict the next cycle. So who could predict? that war would break out in Gaza between Israel and Hamas, and that war would expose the anti-Semitism and racism on college campuses. Who could have predicted that? No one on earth. But now, the unintended consequence of the Gaza war is that the radical left, the progressive movement in America, is under fire. So let's define what we're talking about. Woke and diversity, equity, inclusion is all about racism. It's all about providing opportunities based on skin color and ethnicity or denying opportunities, very important. That's what DEI is. And if you believe in DEI, you're woke. Well, most Americans are waking up to the fact that that is wrong and it's unconstitutional as the Supreme Court has ruled. If you are a corporation, you are not allowed to hire on skin color or ethnicity. You are not allowed. If you are a college or university or high school, whatever, and you have an admissions policy, can't be based on this skin color. Supreme Court has ruled it. And that, of course, is the essence of our democracy, that all men are created equal and should have equal opportunity to pursue happiness. It isn't equal if you are singling out an ethnic group for special treatment. We all have that. Now, the progressive movement doesn't care. It justifies its insanity by saying, oh, because the United States persecuted black people, all right, by slavery and Jim Crow, that we, society, owe them special treatment now while denying other groups fair play. That's a progressive, that's what they believe. And you're not gonna convince them otherwise. So all we can do is put pressure on those people, expose those people as UPenn, Harvard, MIT, and others have been exposed. Enter the University of Utah. Utah, of course, a red state. The pressure in Utah is against DEI woke from the beginning. So the president of Utah is Randall, um, Taylor Randall, Taylor Randall. He issued a statement about Utah's policy going forward. Quote, as the University of Utah strives for excellence in education, research, patient care, and service community, we remain steadfast in our belief and actions that we must have a dedicated team of individuals from every walk of life to help us achieve that goal. As we do so, we affirm our commitment to non discriminatory hiring practices and the well-being of our patients and campus communities, unquote. So he's basically saying that equity is out at the University of Utah. No, not going to do it. Good for him. Every university should adopt that posture. All right. And when they do, I will report it to you, to be fair. Now, we have colleges like Hillsdale, University of the Ozarks, Chapman, Um, that have always never, never gotten into the progressive madness. And they're there. There's a bunch of them. I just named three, but there are 300. You got to research it. So what we have in America now is a good thing. We have an exposure of a bad thing, all right? Providing opportunity on skin color and ethnicity. That is a bad thing because it, goes against equal pursuit of happiness. And that's a memo. Everything is expensive these days, you know that. The government is printing trillions of dollars in consumer prices higher than ever. 
If the government continues its printing and spending, the dollar could continue its free fall and lose its coveted role as the world reserve currency. Let's hope that doesn't happen. But there are a few things you can do right now. American Hartford Gold can show you how to protect your money, your retirement, your hard-earned savings against inflation by helping you diversify a portion of your portfolio into physical gold and silver. Start with a short phone call, and they can have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your 401k or IRA. So please call or text them right now. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you. Call 877-444-GOLD, 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Again, that's 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Thank you for watching the No Spin News. To watch the full episode anytime on BillOReilly.com, please sign up to become a premium or concierge member. Visit BillOReilly.com to sign up and start watching today.